Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm recording with the Samsung Galaxy S8 at full HD 60 frames per second. I have uh, shot a 30 FPS video already which is on my social media and we know that Samsung Galaxy S8 can really record some decent level of video at 30 FPS. Same as the last year on the S7 and the S7 Edge. However the real test is in 60 frames per second especially with autofocus that we had issues on the S7 and the S7 Edge from last year. Only 30 FPS allows you that uh, dual pixel lightning fast focus whereas on the 60 FPS it's uh, at times a bit of a problem. Okay so let's have a look and see if this year we can have some nice Nice autofocus at 60 fps uh, 1080p with the Ga Samsung Galaxy S8. There we go. The leaves are moving, I know, but still it is like he is struggling a bit, even though it's a bit of a tough test. Okay, leave it alone. Let's walk along and see how it goes. So here we go. We got the wall here. So let's get really close to the wall and see if the Galaxy S8 can really focus on the wall. There we go. Struggling, struggling. There we go. Finally, takes about two seconds. Definitely not as quick as on 30 FPS, but uh, pretty quick at uh, compared to uh, other phones in the market. Okay, so here's my car, my baby, the Fiesta ST. So let's have a look and see, go to the wheel and see if we can focus on the Ford logo right in the middle of the tire. There you go, guys, and is able to focus straight away. Not too bad. Uh, the video is a bit... Um, you know um what do you call it um jerky sorry <laughs> yeah a bit wobbly as well uh, obviously my hands are not as stable but still uh, optical image stabilization should help the video be more stabilized hopefully once it gets uploaded on the channel uh, it will be a bit more stable often is the case when i sometimes record stuff and uh, when it comes to coming down to on the video onto the channel it becomes a bit more stable let's get close to the lamp here to the pole sorry and let's have a look and see if you can focus not looking too bad so far so good so very nice okay I'm a bit more happier than I was with the S7 Edge from last year so the focusing speeds are definitely a bit better than what we had from last year even at 60 FPS there you go guys let's do a quick thumb test okay struggling same as last year once more try it once more there you go nope okay bring the thumb a bit further away still not focusing 60 fps it's a struggle especially with when the surface area is less pretty much the same as last year it will struggle let me bring my ford key fob and see if that it gets focused and again it is struggling guys mm, not as good as 30 fps i thought there was an improvement from what i can see it's uh, not much of an improvement on the bigger object with more surface area it finds it easier to focus as you can see there we go we got more surface area to cover so it's easier for 30 fps but we may have less surface area like my thumb for instance or the key fob then it is struggling to focus okay let's uh, bring in that's my engine so let's have a look and see if we can do a few more focusing tests so let's get close to the battery there we go guys really close okay this time around is able to focus but still struggling there's a bit of, bit of, bit of focus hunting going on as you can see and definitely not as accurate, as fast, as quick, and as responsive as we have on a 30 FPS. And even when you go away from the object, and you can see it takes a while before it brings everything back into focus. Let's do this once more. And as you can see, 60 FPS is a bit of a struggle. So guys, that's pretty much it. Me is recording with the Samsung Galaxy S8 at 1080p, 60 FPS. The story is pretty much the same from as from last year. Uh, 60 FPS auto focusing is not as fast as at 30 FPS. Any questions? Please feel free to ask me in the comment section, and please give my video a thumbs up if you like it, and please subscribe to my channel, guys, as it helps. And I shall see you in the next video.